So today we are fighting Momentai. And I want to be attacking this guy. And we are going to be using something I built just recently because she is getting an RTA skin in literally two days and six hours and like three minutes or something. Yeah, three minutes. And uh, I think for my third, I need something that I, I need either a speed lead or if I'm confident in my ALOS, I could just go with something else. But I think I will go with a speed lead. I think I'll go. Red Shuri doesn't really make sense. Go Vildred. I think Red Shuri is the way. Doing it like this. Actually like this, because then yeah. Tenebria and Ras and Well. Well. Like so. And let's just see how this goes because interesting, right? I'll show you my ability. So I have an extra fourteen speed. Pretty sure he would have been at ninety-eight. I'll calculate like after this though. Take this. So the idea is Place. you do this. Oh. Okay. Didn't die. He didn't die. Time for a counter attack. This is bad, right? Now it's time so this lands on my Tenebria. I mean on my Shuri, I just think I just quit. I didn't land on my Aelons. Like if my Aelons kills this this RB here, I win. I should try and silence, right? Oh, so it could be okay. One shot is all it will take. Ha! Huh. I won't lose to anyone. Uh, let's just do this guy. I'm strong. So I need to cycle turns. Let's start. He does this one. There, three focus. Ready. Ha! So easy, bro. <laughs> Not even close. Play with me. She probably shown off her stats, right? She's 4,000 attack, 280 crit damage, and like 170 speed. But this one should be pretty easy. I don't see this going wrong. I do not want to get a little Elbrist lag at all. I'll protect you. Let's buff up. Burn away the evil. Kneel before. Let's see. My sword of light. Miss on that and that. that. Fortune will favor us. I do not want you hitting Tenebria. I want nobody hitting Tenebria. A bloodbath. Delightful agony. Okay. All right, let's do this. Let me just I should save that. Yeah. You may try to defy me. I'm then we sleep. Especially for you. I'm sure Fortune will be on our side today as well. What? 
You know, it's kind of suck that my uh, Ras is faster than my Tenebria right now. now. Oh my, how cute. Let's do this. Because I won't die to an, to an Elbrus. That might hurt a little bit. Should we get started? I could just do this. I really need a dual attack from Royal with Tenebria. But Or I could just sleep like that, you know. That also works. I'm sure. Immature. A nightmare. There we go. For you. So that was that. Um, oh, otherwise, it wasn't. She didn't crit. Man. Bye. But I'll be back with the next. Hopefully, we can make. Oh, dude, I just realized there was a two Tenebrius. But hopefully, in the next fight, I can make Spectre Tenebrius shine just a little bit more. So, for my next opponent, I kind of want to try. Regular Tenebria against Spectre Tenebria. And then for the bottom one, we're gonna go C-Dom instead of Watcher Shuri. And just hope this isn't an, uh, an uh, what's it called, Holy Sack Crow. And the idea is that we Soul Burn and we kill this, then C-Dom kills this. And then I'm gonna die, and then I'm gonna kill this guy. Very nice. That, 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 that's the plan. Uh, Krau can't horse my uh, Spectre Tenebria, so she'll be safe from that. I don't mind losing gone. anyone else. The, the idea here is actually just stunning Emil Tenebria. For so long. I don't know if there's speed on this guy. She's gonna do that. No destiny can stop me. But there's no k -Ron, so there's no immediate threat. Except for that. My path. That's a thing that can happen. Fall into a nightmare. Trying to strip this attack. Nope. You may try to defy me. Well, in theory, I could do this. Cute. I want to torment you. Oof. Fortune will face what us. I do. Oof. So that was that was kind of, I was kind of being a bully there. But should I fight like lots? So yeah, I've got six souls here. Do this just in case. There's no speed. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna do this. Oh, I'm bored. See how much this does. Oh, Ooh. you want to try me? I feel like if I use uh, do I need to make sure this ML can dies? Based on that damage, I want to say it's definitely 100% Holy Sack Crow. Because there is no way Aureus. You know, I could actually test it. If I did this. It is Aureus. But yeah, I just need to make sure that. He just needs to make sure this thing died, basically. DM on Ken. Oh! Look at me. I said look at me. You know, that is sort of bad. Um, I think what I do is... I S2 here, and then... I mean, I S3 here. Then I just hit the crow. And with Emil Tenebria and Aelots, I should be able to... My Aelots should lap this crowd, basically. Then I should be able to attack boost my Seedom again, and then kill the Emil Ken. The strongest. 
who I'm going for. I think that's that's the best play. Basically, do this. Yeah, so my lots actually laps. So I forgot I locked him into sacred death. Eighteen thousand HP. So it's definitely good I didn't go for the uh I should try and cycle this. Oh you want to try me? Let's do this. I am the strongest. Do you think I can kill that ML can? This would mark the end of my A lots though. Is it worth I think it's worth trying. And I killed the cow as well. Big brain. Of course I'm the greatest. Woohoo! So yeah, I'll be back with the last. So for my last attack, I want to be attacking this guy. And for the top one, I'm gonna try utilizing her stun on ML Ken turn four or something. I need that to go a little bit of turns. I'm actually gonna be attacking this Serato first. So, we're gonna use this. For the bottom one, just simple Elena, cockflock this Charles after ML Bazaar moves. Then just hope the Charles actually kills Arby so that Elena goes and protects Arby for after. K1 would win it out just after Arby damage, like in general, so. No need to be worried. I thought I was finally free. Need to take speed. Okay. That. Ugh, I'm bored. So we want to try and stun this guy. Kiss my feet. This defense buff is bad. I will step on you. Ugh, this is hard. Is probably gonna kill this ML Ken. I'm warning you. I've got nothing to lose. Oh, he resisted. I used my stun. Uh oh. I thought I didn't use my stun. Shit. Miss? Okay, so I, I literally just threw. I thought I still had my stun. Man, fuck. I mean, there's a chance you could, like, 1v2 him if she lands a poison here. Oh. Ah! Not even close. Suck a dick. So the idea was to stun the ML Ken so that I had a... Uh... Fuck. Wait, is this K-Run really He's faster? Oh no, it's not. Okay. <laughs> that would've been bad. This troll sucks. This is gonna be a really bad representation. I should really do it when my uh, K-Run moves. Chosen ones. Blessings of the stars. Hold on, it's gonna do it with my K run moves because that's a little bit better. Obey, kneel. Everything disappears. Yeah, that's a little bit better. And we are just gonna see if we can just. This obviously won't break. kill, but it's gonna do enough for what I need to do. I actually might just kill. 
Oh. I'll be your opponent. Almost. Chaos. Look beyond the sky. Yeah, so my Kron already won. There is no salvation for those who fall your torment excites me. A bloodbath. Delightful. There are beads to take, which is whatever. 28k, that's a lot of damage. The stars light our way. Ashes to ashes. Dust. Oh, I missed crit. He has so much crit, that's kind of insane, dude. Oh, Elena gets the kill. Nice. So, that was Guild War and Emerald Nibria debut. She did okay, dude. Like, she did her best. But I think she needs more skill ups and possibly a little bit of a change because it's only plus 7. And as I said, she's 4k attack and like 280 crit damage. Her speed is really low, which I really want to change. And her HP is not that great. Uh, this is a lot. Just speed. But thanks for watching. I'll be back later.